Hey guys, welcome back to Tinker Engineering. Today we're gonna make a DIY quill feather pen. Now it's just a feather pen, it's really cool. So what you'll need is some pens, craft feathers or real feathers, they work, you just gotta wash them, okay. Um, some scissors to cut the tips of your pens off and a hot glue gun. Um, so take um, your feather pen and cut off the tip. Okay, just the tip. So it's open. That. You can see that. You're going to take your pen and you're going to put it up the thing. Okay, you're going to measure it and make sure it can fit. Or at least some of it can fit. If most of it does not fit, like this much doesn't fit, and that's kind of weird, cut some of it off. Or just make a line with your scissors, so like this. Okay, you'll see that line. So take some hot, actually no. Okay, you're gonna cut this, and then you're gonna cut the ink. Now be very careful, the ink might leak. So yeah, I just be careful. Okay, once you got that, size it again to make sure it fits good. Perfect. Now you're gonna take your hot glue gun, leave, I wouldn't, I would barely even push it. Just leave a bit of heat on it, like a booger, then jam it up. And yep, that should keep it in place. Now, you're gonna put a bit more. Whoa, 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 whoa. And don't put too much, just put a little bit more. Now if you put too much, just wipe it off, because it's easy to wipe off. Napkin, or you can use the hot glue gun. I'd suggest using the hot glue gun, not the napkin, because it might burn up the napkin, and that might burn up your workshop, or whatever place you're using. And there you go. Just let that to dry. And yeah. So repeat this process for the other pens. And once you've got that, you know. Just also for your feather, you can add whatever touches you want to your feathers. So really doesn't matter. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, also, please leave a like and subscribe to Tinker Engineering. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye. Woo! Go Quill Feather.